This person right here is Rhys Jones, who is from Cannock, the West Midlands. Now Rhys has packed his bags, sunscreen and sandals and ventured all the way to Magnificent Blackpool for a much needed holiday. However, 27 year old Rhys had a temper and whenever he had a few drinks, he thought he was He-Man and had the strength of 10 men. So while in Blackpool on August 15th, of 2023, Reese had squared up to 23-year-old barman George Fenlon, while both men were out in separate groups. George was described as a gentle and all-around good person. At the time of the confrontation, George had been trying to intervene in a squabble outside the bar, all because Reese Jones had tried to convince a woman to leave her boyfriend and go with him instead. Now Reese got into an argument with the woman's boyfriend. The two men then stepped into the alleyway on the strand. This is when George passed by and tried to call hot tempers. Getting between the men in quick succession, Rhys Jones had struck George with a flurry of blows. George had no chance to react. The impact caused George to drop to the ground at least twice. He did manage to get back up, but then Rhys Jones landed another strike. This would prove fatal. George was left unconscious and in the aftermath, Rhys Jones clapped his hand as if pleased with himself and applauding his actions. He then took a taxi back to his hotel. He then gathered his belongings, made his way back home to Cannock. Meanwhile, emergency services rushed to the Strand at 2am. George was worked on at the scene before being taken to the Royal Preston Hospital. George had to undergo multiple surgeries and this was a person that was getting ready to meet their child. But sadly, on November 22nd, he was pronounced dead, three months later. For the incident, Reese Jones was initially charged with GBH. He answered no comment to all questions when interviewed. The crime was then upgraded to the M. So then, Reese Jones pled guilty to manslaughter. Now, Reese Jones was jailed for 10 years and 2 months. Again, he deprived George of being a father. Does the crime match the sentence? Let me know. And condolences. Stay safe, safe.